one great truth is that if God observed all the iniquities that exist in the hearts of almost every person, why do you say almost, doctor? Because many passed away, they were saved and no longer exist. They all went to heaven. So then, who could stand before God? There is no way, but he is merciful, folks. He looks at us, gives us the power to be delivered from sins, even from our evil thoughts. Those we have deep in our soul, we cannot allow any kind of, any kind of iniquity to abide in us, because if we allow it, the iniquity will come in and it will take over our life. But we are the property of the Lord God in Psalm chapter 130, verse number three says, if you, Lord, should mark iniquities, O Lord, who could stand? The Lord pays attention to how you handle his word, folks. He will give more to those who seek him, and he sees that you are seeking him. Those who do not seek God will lose many things. Always seek the Lord, folks. Take a look at a person who was blessed. What happened to you, sister? I accidentally burned myself. I burned my abdomen, Uh my Uh entire body. I was a compulsive smoker. These are the burn scars here. The scars are all from the burn, and my arm was 18 centimeters shorter. How did you burn yourself? Using alcohol. How was your arm before, sister? It was shorter. I couldn't stretch it more than this. How about now? Now I can stretch it normally. (laughs) Look. How beautiful is that, folks? I am so amazed. I am so emotional. Oh, Jesus. I never came here before, and God already did this work in my life. I am so grateful. Thanks be to God. Shall we say a prayer now? Father, thank you for not observing the iniquities that many times grows in our heart, Lord. But we pray that you guard and protect the gates of our heart so that iniquity cannot reach us. My Lord, now I will bless the lives of these people who are praying with me and order all evil to get out of these lives now, right now, in the name of Jesus Christ. Have a good day. 